Hey there, this is Salman and you are watching Zetalysis. In this video, I have a phone. This is Vivo Y11 and this is pattern and pin lock. So in this video, we will learn how to remove its pin lock. As you can see there, this phone is pin locked. It is a Qualcomm a Snapdragon based phone and there is no easy way to remove its lock. So we have to try to remove this lock. In order to remove its lock, so first we have to disassemble it. And with the test points method, we have to get its ADL port in Windows PC. And then after using MRT Vivo tool software, we have to remove this lock. So first we have to disassemble this. In order to disassemble this, first power of this phone. And after that, just remove its SIM tray. After removing its SIM tray, just carefully remove its back cover, carefully remove its cable and try not to break its fingerprint sensor ribbons. After removing its back cover, unscrew it with a screwdriver, use any appropriate screwdriver. After unscrewing its top part, just remove this plastic covering. Keep these screws in a safe place. After removing this plastic cover, just remove this safety covering of this fingerprint sensor ribbon. After removing it, just remove the ribbon of the fingerprint sensor and completely separate the back cover. After that, just remove the battery ribbon connector from motherboard. And after that, just remove this rubber plastic covering from this connector in order to show the test points. Because one of the test points are hidden under this plastic covering. After removing, just we have to shorten these two test points as I'm showing here. Carefully see which test points you have to short. This is Vivo Y11. Code name is Vivo 1906. After removing this plastic covering, we have to shorten this phone with these test points with any tweezers or anything else that is available for you and simultaneously we have to connect the phone with the usb cable with our windows pc so we found its test points now come to the windows interface you have to download some softwares for this first you have to download qualcomm drivers according to your windows version first download the qualcomm drivers and exit into your desktop The installation is simple easy. Next, next, next finish like process. After that, download 64 debugging software. Extract it on the desktop. And download and extract MRT Vivo Unlock Tool on your desktop. I am placing all the links for the necessary softwares in the description below. You can download from there. Now open this 64 debugging software. Go to release folder. 
go to x32 folder now right click on this x32 debug.x executable file right click on it and run as administrator it is necessary to run as an administrator and by using this software we will debug and bypass the mrt vivo tool just to maximize the software click open this and go to the directory where you have extracted the mrt vivo tool as i had extracted on my desktop go to mrt vivo tool folder select the mrt vivo tool main executive executable file and double click or click on ok open this all is some type of assembly language so we have no concern about studying it only we have to follow the steps to start the software mrt vivo tool in order to start the software first steps are click on this run button and after that wait for few seconds and again click on this run button now wait for it until the software is started now in the taskbar you can see that the mrt vivo tool is launched somehow now we can check this if it is working or not on the taskbar click on this as you can see that mrt dongle not found do not click ok do not click ok now we just pass this debugger only for this just click on this pause button the debugging process will be passed now in the bottom right window here you can see a multiple of percentage signs and above this the line is empty and above the empty line there is the name of the file right click on this address of this empty line now just click on follow dvod in disassembler now in the main window you have to double click and add a breakpoint on this address this address might be changed for you uh, it may be it may be something else it might be something but you have to find this address and just double click here and it will add a breakpoint to this address and again double click to the next mouse line and add another breakpoint here so all things are finished so all the process is done now now to finally click on this run button and the software will run now click on this mrt software now you see a warning access violation address just click ok and boom the software is bypassed now just minimize this debugging software do not close it open device manager so we can check that if we had correctly connected our phone with pc or not now grab the tweezer or forcep and hold the usb cable with other hand just show these test points with tweezer and at the same time connect to usb cable with your phone it might be some difficult task for you you're trying first time but try two and three times you will get the comport in your device manager as we got the port in device manager successfully you can see here qualcomm hsusb qd loader 9008com4 now from this software interface just select the phone model y11 not, not present here just select vivo y93 y95 v11 and now click on hit start and after the few moments it will done its process The software did its job done successfully. Now just remove the USB cable and then just connect back the battery connector to the main board. Now press and hold the power key to reboot the device. The device will automatically boot up in recovery mode. Now just click on clear all data. Just click OK. And it started erasing all the data. Now the phone will reboot.
and you have to wait a few minutes to reach the startup screen so i am fast forwarding this process for you to save your precious time just do next 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 and until you reach the startup screen And here in the set, we can check about this phone. As you can see this, this model number is Vivo 1906 and it is a Snapdragon based mobile phone. So in this video, we successfully removed the password log of Vivo Y11, Vivo 1906. I hope that you enjoyed this video and you learned something from this video and if you did make sure to give the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and just not only subscribe ring the bell so you'll never miss any upcoming tips tricks and tutorials thanks for watching and stay tuned i will see you in my next so until then keep smiling